Uh, hi, my name is Essie McGrath and this is my story titled The Fumble and Stumble. Reaching out with my hand on my kitchen table and fumbling around searching for a fork is a voice of discovery for me. And on the way I've already found the salt, the pepper and the tomato ketchup. And then suddenly someone put a knife into my hand. And I was really confused and said, why have you put a knife into my hand? Mm. And she said, oh, I thought that's what you were looking for. Let me make my own mistakes. Don't preempt and share your mistake with me. Leave my thoughts to run a natural course and I will find my own happy ending. If you want, you could come with me and walk with me on a journey of mutualism. And on the way, you could say to me, there's a rose out there. And I will turn to that rose and touch it and experience its beauty through my fingertips. And I will smell its scent. And if I hit a thorn on the way, that's my risk to own. And you don't have to say sorry to me. I'm just feeling around and working out my space, my environment. So let me fumble and stumble. And I will build up a map of the space in my mind. And therefore, will be a much more autonomous and resilient deafblind person. So I invite you into my space, my world, and I will show you the way, not through your ears or your eyes, but rather through my fingertips and my sense of touch.